Magazine of 30 rounds! Stand out! M! Can you see a target there? Yes, yes sir! Fire! Number one, clear your shot! Number two, clear your shot! Number three, clear your shot! Yes, friend! Magazine of 30 rounds! Little loud! M! Can you see a tiger there? Yes, yes, sir. Fire! 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 Out! Number one, clear, sir! Number two, clear, sir! Number three, clear, sir! Yes. We are going to fire, woman! Loud! Move! Fire! Move! Fire! Move! Fire! Number one, clear, sir. Number two, clear, sir. Number three, clear, sir. What? When did it happen? Okay, okay, okay. I'll be right there, I'll be right there. What is it? <sighs> My wife has just been rushed to the hospital and uh, she's in a critical condition. My presence is needed right now. Please, 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 please. My appointment supersedes everything. Okay? Please rush to the place immediately. Don't don't ever talk about this. Sir, please let me drive to my wife now. Dada, my appointment first. Do you hear me? Please take me right. Look, I'm losing the appointment though. Dada. Dada. Dada, where are you going to? Oh my god. Dada! Oh my god! What kind of woman thing is this? Dada! Oh! You decided to abandon me here? Oh my god! You regret it! Honestly, you regret it!
Víctor. What is it? Hmm? I can't diagnose yet. But she looks bad. I need to be moved fast. Where? The general hospital in Lagos. She has to be flown there immediately. So, I'll try and raise the necessary fund. drive myself to the meeting. Wow. Upon all, I missed my appointment. You don't mean it. Why would he do anything like that? Complaining that his wife was sick. Blah, 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 blah. Just, I, I do, that, that boy is his son. He's mad. Why are you here? Huh? I'm very sorry, sir. Sir, my wife's situation is very critical, so I, I need your help, sir. Oh, you need my help? Yes, sir. It's okay. Dada? Sir? You are fired. Hey, sir, please, please. Sir, please. You can't fire me now, sir, please, please. My wife is dying in the hospital and she needs to be flown to the specialist hospital in Lagos immediately. And what's my business about it? Sir, please, help me. Please leave my house! Sir, please. Madam, please, don't let my wife Dada, die, please. Leave Madam, my please, house! Me, don't let my wife die, please. She's everything I have. I said leave my house. Please, uh, do you want me to call the security man? <laughs> to push you out? I will call in the security man to chase you out of this place. What are you trying to do, Lom? Dumbo! 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 What are you trying to do? Dumbo! Doctor, please. Doctor. Hello, Mama. Doctor. Doctor, please. Oh. Please, doctor. Doctor. Hello, Mama. Hello, Mama. Doctor. Doctor. Hey. Doctor. 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 Doctor.
What are you doing there? What's the meaning of this? Fifteen good years I served you, but you let my wife west away in the hospital. You son of a retired arm robber! Is this? I will tell you what it means to be a son of a retired arm robber. Dada, it is following you are committing! Dada! I swear you must go in for it! Spend behind bar. <laughs> Sorry. Judgment has been delivered, and we can't reverse it. <laughs> My sweet Rebecca. Rebecca. Sweetie. 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 Until Madame comes to bring it out, is that? Hey, no, sir. Waka! Sorry, sir. Go and set the table. No, bring it. Sweet to, sweet to, sweet to, sweet to, Sweetheart, how are you? Yes, my Yes. Welcome. Thank you, my dear. <laughs> More teddy bears? Oh, I don't think it's too much. This is not too much for them. They need it. Sweetheart, good news. What is it? I've decided to contest for the upcoming local government election. Really? Yes. You know, I've always wanted to be a politician and the thing is still running hot <coughs> in my blood vein at least that's a starting point towards ruling this state <laughs> first lady <laughs> she says so. yeah my dear i'll get you your food please first about it i really need it thank you very much mm. chris my beloved son Okay, the lame man. Bring that in for your sister. Has Chris gone to sleep? Yes, they are asleep. I've like, checked them, they're all right. Just get down there, glance at them, and see how it's. Honey, I don't like the way you're handling Chris. I don't like it at all. I don't understand. Children are like young tenors. The way you nurture them, 
determine what they become in the future. I agree with you. You over pampering Chris. Whatever he wants, you give to him. He is my only son. And when I build my political dynasty, he will inherit it. Then you have to start now to make him a man. Forget about it. I don't want Chris to go through the deprivation I went through while growing up. Anything he needs, as much as I live, he will get the best of it. You can train your daughter the way you deem fit. Chris is my prince. Oh, honey, are you discriminating? Not at all, oh, I am not. But don't forget that Jane will be married out while Chris bears the name tag or offer Chief <laughs> Okoria. <laughs> Mommy, that's no fair. I just wish you listen to me. Don't lose your sleep. on him. I asked him to go and take his bath and he refused and you're saying I'm harsh on him. How? It's okay. Uh, uh, Chris, go and take your bath. Daddy will buy some goodies for you, okay? you watch the thing after. Okay, if you go. Ne break on the kopu. Ne break on the kopu. Ne break on the kopu. So what are you still doing here? What you said? I said what? Please get out of my parlor. Go and stay outside. Okay. Mom doesn't allow me to do whatever I want. Every time she was saying, stop this, stop this. I can't just wait to grow up. I can't just wait to grow up so that I can do whatever I want. Will turn into something negative in the future. Uh -uh. 
Are you sure you are not being paranoid? You need to see him yesterday. You need to see the way he was posing in front of the mirror, just like his father. Giving orders to imaginary talks. Children do that all the time. Your husband is his role model. Role model, you say? Mm -hmm. Something tells me that boy will not be a gentleman when he grows up. <laughs> children are like that. My children are like that too. Really? Yes. They will outgrow the negative traits. Are you sure? Of course, yes. Don't worry. Just be real. Don't worry. So, what do I want? What's your problem? Come on, stay there. Let me back you. What's your problem now? Mommy doesn't like me. I'm a big boy. You are a big boy. Mm -hmm. Thank you. I can go by myself. I'm not sure you take somebody. I'm a big boy now. I do whatever I want. I'm a big boy now. I can do whatever I want. I'm a big boy now. <laughs> Man, is, this, is this where I asked you to stop? I'm sorry. Water. Sorry for yourself. Sorry, sir. Which kind of sorry, sir? What is it? Huh? Sorry, sir. Uh, Chris. Yes, Dad. Yeah, it's 200 naira for your snacks. Thank you, Dad. Thank you. Thank you. Bye-bye. Okay. Honey. Don't you think it's too much? What is too much? Huh? What's your business? He's my son. He deserves more than that. Maxwell, you're turning Chris into... In, into what? Huh? Into what? I just think 200 naira for his snacks is too much. It is not too much. It's not too much for him. Chris is my son. Chief. Okoria's son. He deserves more than that. Oh, yeah, driver, go, 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 go. Let's go and drop this woman at, at her salon. Go ahead. Yes, sir. Uh. Yes, sir.
Michael, what did you score in your last test today? 60 percent. You? 40 You? 4 You? 70 You? 8 You? 9 You? My God. Well done. But you forgot to put in a picture. It's a fashion. You have to do the thing with the pasta. And you too. You have to be like me. You have to be like me. The boss mm. Forget about what you scored. Mm. I'll buy everybody snacks today. Hey. But on one condition. You all will now call me Buster. Buster? Yes. I am the Buster. You all will call me Buster. And you all will respect me. Host! Host!
Let me go, man. Hey, what's up, man? I guess you're from heaven. Maybe, and I guess you're from hell. No way. Actually, um, my name is Chris, aka Buster. You know what I'm saying? My friends call me Dad. I'm nameless, okay? Ooh. Oh well, um, let's. Just... Yes, I got it. You are Rose. Whatever. Mm, well, um. Alright then. Can I get your number? I could call her back at you, you know what I'm saying? No! Yes, okay? Excuse me. What? Senator Liu. My chief. You know we have come a long way. That is true. And there's no way we will allow this golden opportunity slip of our hand. <laughs> okay. All I'm expecting from you is 100% support. You, you doubt me being a good friend? How can? <laughs> ah, me. That's my boy. Oh. Is that you? <laughs> That's your mom. <laughs> God! Mom, you look beautiful than the queen on the other side. Well, you can you. say that again. <laughs> yeah, there. Thank you. Thank you, bro. How are you doing? We have here, Senator Ali. <laughs> good afternoon, sir. Good afternoon, my good boy. Wow. How is the carrot thing going? Oh, fine, I mean. Exactly. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> what a I am fine. I'm the best. Uh, yeah. It's all about self-defense, anyway. Yeah, straight up. Yeah, <laughs> because you never know when you need to protect yourself. You yeah. Know? Excuse me, please. Okay. Go on. I need to get changed. Oh, no, 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 no. That's a spot boy inside. I'm really proud of him. I'm telling you, he's a spot boy. So, you are assuring me of your commitment, support. Chief, you don't have any problem. I'm going to support you until you become the governor of the state. To God be the glory. Amen. 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 skills. Really? With loads of stamina. Mm -hmm. 
I can see lovely sister. I can see those muscles. Yeah, baby. Really Bruce Lee type, man. Oh. You know what I'm saying? What's cooking, really man? Oh. What you got? Juice. You want some? Oh. I prefer juice. I don't want pineapples. Maybe when I extract it, you know? Oh, yes, after that. But listen, can I tell you something? What is it? Um. You want to hear it? Curse. Um, I saw my dream girl today. So, who is this girl? You want me to tell you more? Someone this stakeholders caucus meeting to enable us put heads together and raise funds for a great party for the forthcoming gubernatorial elections. Uh, you know, elections in this country now is very cost intensive. So for a party to be viable, it needs money. Um, without wasting much of your time, mm, does anybody have anything to say? of this great party, the People's Republic Party, as a party for the future. And knowing fully the importance of money in a political party like ours, money makes party vibrant and relevant. That is why we are here. And it is only when we put our heads together and donate generously that we will be looking forward to winning massively. However, on behalf of my beautiful wife and myself, we humbly donate just for a takeoff, for a start, a token sum of 25 million naira. Um, 
On behalf of the members of this sacred party, I will simply say that we can't thank you enough. We know what you've been doing. Uh, in line with this, uh, I am appealing to other stakeholders of this great party to emulate Chifokori and donate handsomely to our great party. P R P.
Spoiled brat. I mean, look, Buster, spag, naughty girls, you know. <laughs> Did you just call me a brat? Oh, oh listen, <laughs> easy. I mean, in a personal way, you know, like beautiful brat. You know? Good sense of humor. Um, Chris, what do you do? Oh, uh, I'm her. <clears throat> I'm at the State University uh, studying engineering. <laughs> you know how we do. Okay, yeah. I see. Yeah. Okay, yes, I really have to go now. Okay, well, can I have your number then? Ring, ring. You can leave me alone, okay? Pretty boy in the line, baby girl. Pretty boy, how are you? Um, not fine. 
Are you sick? Oh yeah, I uh, love sick baby. With who? We need African queen, of course. Which kingdom does this your African queen? <laughs> My kingdom. Missing arm. How about lunch tomorrow? I'll be busy. What about day after tomorrow? Um, busy. And the day after? I'll be making my hair. Oh, so when do I get to see you then? I don't know. Oh, come on, talk to me, man. Don't move faster than your shadow. Oh, come on, baby. No way in the shadow is part of the body. I can not think that. Oh, okay, I'll call you. You mean you don't have a number? Are you calling from a public phone? Good night, pretty boy. Hey. Is that all? Yeah, yeah, I mean, I never felt like that before, you know. I... I suggest... You take it nice and slow. Oh, Jane, you know now, love can't wait. It always does. You want my advice? Mm hmm. I'll give it to you. Hmm? I think she's playing hard to get. Mm -hmm. Don't act desperately. Just show how you're in control of your destiny. <laughs> okay? Then make it cool and cocky. Yes. Cocky? Yeah. <laughs> cocky. Be, be arrogant in a positive way. Add joke to it. Then get her laughing all the time. Then you have your day. What if it doesn't work? There are lots of fishes in the ocean. Oh, and damn, love. please. This fish is rare. Then, go for Juliet. Romeo. <laughs> oh God. Romeo and Juliet. Yes, now. Hmm. Well, that's a lot, sis. You know, you're my light in the dark. <laughs>
Yep. Um, where were you when the schoolgirl was reading? I don't understand. <laughs> I mean, you look too old to be an undergraduate. Oh! <laughs> Are you of that? I stutter late. <laughs> Never too late to start. <laughs> Mm hmm. <laughs> Free to dance, sir. Yeah. I'm using that. Here, 200,000 
Hi, lad. Thanks a lot, then. Ooh. Oh, my one. Chris is always getting what he wants. Uh, 200,000 naira for an undergraduate. The young man needs money. You should exercise some restraint the way you dole it out to him. Well, sweetheart, a good dog, they say, deserves a good boy. He's a good kid, my son. Time will tell. It's okay. Actually, you haven't told me nothing about your family, you know. Um, my parents live in the States. My dad is a medical doctor there. Mmm, for real? But, uh, how come you're not there leaving with them, I mean? Um, let's say, um, I love my country. <laughs> all good. And when the, you know, you got all the stuff, man, your cars and houses and this and that. You can see everything. Mm, yeah. Um, but um, come to think of it, we've never discussed about our parents. I don't know anything about your background, but I know that you're rich. Yes. <laughs> rich. Oh, God help me. 
Mm, well, um, my father is a government contractor. But right now, he's transformed into a politician, you know. My mom's a bit on the conservative side, but uh, she's an interior decorator. And then I have this little sister I love so much. Man. Her name is Jane. I am. Um, I can't wait to meet them. <laughs> oh, no problem. Ain't soon. Please don't leave me. Come on, I wouldn't do that. Okay, y'all. I promise you I'll do everything I can. There's something I've been meaning to tell you. What was that? I want to marry you. <laughs> so. Yeah, uh, we've been dating for three months now. And even though your father is very rich, he was still very humble and domesticated. Above all, I see every quality I need in a wife. I, I, I just don't want to get married now. To be my master's degree. Oh. That's uh, 18 months from now. Mm. Oh, it's okay. I'll wait. To whenever you're ready, I'll wait for you. I'll think about it. Well, it's okay, it's okay, whatever, it's all right. Sam, please, don't be downcast here. I, I love my family so much that I find it difficult contemplating leaving them. I know, I know, but definitely you leave them one day. You get yourself a husband. I know, I know. I know that. It's a task that needs to be done. Sam is a nice person 
and he has a good job. Mommy, okay. If I should leave now, we'll be helping you out at home. Baby, I will cope. I will cope. But still, Mommy, Sam has to wait. He has to wait. He has to wait. Until I'm showing my master's degree. Who got there? How is it progressing? Perfect setup. Soon, very soon, the rain will start falling and it's going to be a heavy downpour. <laughs> Chris, I gave you 200,000 naira a fortnight ago. What happened to it? 
well that I have expensive cars and you know I go clubbing the weekend to relax with my friends and sometimes I help them what a minute you know. are you saying you are now running a charity organization well that it's not that Chris you should try to understand that money does not grow on trees do you know that Yes, I know about that. By the way, how much are we talking about here? Well, um... 350,000 now, Oh, my God. Dad, it's talks, man. That's good business. Look, you never deprived me of anything, man. Yes, Chris. I never deprived you of anything because I love you. But you are really becoming reckless with money, and that is not good. Dad, I want to invest in, in stocks. I want to buy stocks. Don't you understand, Dad? <laughs> well, That's good of you. Now you've started thinking about investment. The act of making money. So, what companies talk are we talking about? Oh, well, that, um, the stock broker is going to talk to me about that later. It's okay. I'm glad to hear that. And in that case, I think, uh, I'll make it up to half a million. Ooh, Dad, God. As much as you are going to buy stock. What are you talking about, Dad? I mean, you should have seen me the dead gun to the bank, man. All the chicks were all gaping at me. All the guys were getting jealous and all that. They said, where you got all the money you go buy stocks from? That's the first time, babe. You know, well. Eighty grand. Oh, darling, thank you so much. Oh, thank you so much, an angel. Oh, thank you. Oh. <laughs> thank you. Wow. 
Oh, listen, let me tell you something. I'll do anything for you, baby. Anything. Anything. Come here. What? Do you have a surprise for me? And it's shut in one. considered going to the Caribbean? No. Um, don't you think it would be fun? You know, you and I going to spend the week there? Hmm, darling? Hmm? Don't you think it would be fun, you know, you and I going to spend the week I there? I heard you the first time. Yes, not a bad idea. You know, um, you and I join soul to soul with nature. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Where did you get that from me? That sounds romantic, you know. So, well, why don't we go in a fortnight? Involves money, right? My roommate is equal to the task. Alright, yeah, yeah. See what I can do. <laughs> Thanks, darling. Mm. <laughs> Said, <clears throat> I'll see you tomorrow. Probably after the quiz. All right. Um, Chris, hope you're ready for the class. Hmm. Chris. No more. Look, don't panic. I'm the best. You know I would do. <laughs> Come here. In my own view, I suggest that the party gubernatorial ticket naturally should go to Chief of Korea. Well, on paper, yes, but politics is not all about the most qualified candidates. It is all about the politician who has tested political waters, the politician who knows the jigripogri of politics. And that politician is no other person than Chief Okori. I have tested the political waters. I have been a political apprentice for so many years. I think this is my turn. Besides, I have the grassroots support. And so does Prince Uche. Huh. Gentlemen, if we are talking about money here, I think I have enough to go around without any section of the political party complaining. I want us to be mindful of the fact that Prince Uche's godfather is an oil merchant. And also a dirty man. Oh. Have you forgotten the open secret that he, he uses wife for Richard? No. Have you not? Maybe he's not aware of it. That is mere rumor. 
it has not been substantiated. Yeah. Anyway, that is not the issue. And what is the issue? The issue is that our great party maintains a level playing field for all its contestants. The party cannot afford to risk that. We need a formidable candidate to contest with other parties' candidates. And that formidable candidate is Chief Okoria. I support you. I have all it takes. Many. Personality. Education. The way we are. Just name it. I have all it takes to take this great party to the promised land. The government house is waiting for my entry. And this is a game for Chief Okoria and no other person. <laughs> That's who we should be. John, why can't you get it? It's over. No! It's not over. We had a part. And it cannot be over until I say so. For God's sake, we have been dating for four good years. John, please, please. I won't fall for your ostensible character again. John, I like you so much. Why do you want to walk away? She won't understand. What won't I understand, Betty? What? It's a family affair. How would that affect our relationship? John is for your own good. My hands are full now. I have a duty which I must perform. Duty? Yes, duty. And you're not part of it. I'm sorry. Chris, this has to stop. Look, there, I, I need the money, you know. 600,000 naira. Incredible. Huh. What are you talking about, Dad? I mean, you are rich. I mean, we are supposed to be spending your money, for God's sake. Stop this mumbo jumbo, mister. Stop it. More than one million naira in three weeks! Ah! So what? Look, Dad, I buy stocks, man. Liar, Chris! I called our stockbroker and he did not buy any jack. Rather, you flush money down the drain. Look, Dad. I must have the money, man. Is that a threat? Chris, you are not going to get any cover from me. Look, the party is over. It is about time you realize that money is hard to come by. And let me tell you, you must work for any cobble that will come from me right from today. <laughs> How can you think that is possible, Dad? Look, you fed me with a golden spoon and not a silver one. Now you expect to come take it out of my mouth in a rush? That is exactly what I'm going to do. 
removing that golden spoon from your mouth. And this is final. It's all good. Huh. No problem. We're playing Castro. <laughs> and how you want it? Did, 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 did you hear a song? Huh? More than a million naira on that three weeks. Just three weeks. Oh my God. Don't drag me into it. Don't just drag me into it at all. I cautioned you earlier on, but you wouldn't listen. Oh, Chris is your favorite son. That won't suffer any deprivation. Osugun. <laughs> oh, God. I never had this golden opportunity. Huh? I never had this opportunity Chris has now, and he's misusing it. My parents never treated me this way. You. Come on, guy, let it out, man. Let it out. I don't believe it, man. What? <laughs> Damn. You know what my old man did to me? He said he loved me, man. He cut my cash flow, man. I swear to God. And what is the excuse for that? Man, you was talking about some movement, you know. I don't know if it was GMT or whatever. Some jagging about the pattern, which I upload the goddamn dough, you know. Well, you tell me, man. They, I mean. Ain't people supposed to make money to, to share it, you know, spend it or something? <laughs> but that's the essence of making money. You make money so that you can spend money. So what's he talking about? Hey, please, that's man. Come on, man. I'm gonna have all the cash. Yeah, sure. Take it easy, man. I'm sorry. Hey, oh, man, Chris. Hey. All the cash. Yeah, you're gonna have the cash, man, but you sorry, don't have guys. to spill my drink. Yeah, take sorry, it easy. Sorry, sorry.
Step my car. <laughs> what? For real, man. <laughs> I gotta get some cash out. And get rocking on. Sell your car? You heard me. What do you think, man? Chris. Yes. You don't have to sell your car. Why? I do not think it's a wise decision. <laughs> My father stepped my cash flow, man. I mean, what do you think? I get, look, that's Betty over there, man. I, I promised her some good treat to the Caribbean, man. You know, a, a, a boat yeah, cruise yeah, yeah, and yeah, a love boat yeah. movement. Yeah, the... Now listen to me. No matter whatever you do, do not sell that car. Do you hear me? Do not sell that car. Sell it. That's my shop. That's my shop. You two like free shops. Yeah? Okay, take. Ah. Don't talk. 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 I've been thinking, 
I don't think I'm comfortable with this Chris idea. I don't think so. Uh, why? See, crime. Crime for money. Man. You know that I'm from a decent family, man. I'm from a decent background. You can't do that. Decent background? What are you talking about? Okay. Morality first. Man, this is a very wrong idea. It's evil. Suppose you will get killed in the process. What happens? Man, think of Morality. You talk about morality. Well, let me tell you what I know. I know that poverty is a disease. Come to think of it. If not for Chris, do you think we will be where we are today? I mean, look at you. <laughs> look at me. Huh? <laughs> at least. I know where I'm coming from. Hey, Thank you. Oh, quite cool. for you work on a school and my coffee. Thank you. I don't brother. Eh, Mama Ga Gawaya. Yes. Yes, Papa. Eh, what's you Savior. For real. From the university, eh? Yes, Papa. We are, we are I thank God. Yes, I cannot reach it. Hey! But where are you coming from? I'm not from the farm. You look good. Uh, <laughs> thank you. But it's actually a, a good meal for one of my friends. It's very nice. Education good. <laughs> Hi, Papa. Fine. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Hey! Ah, that's full 
your shop. Yeah. Club shop. Battery feature DC. Central lock. Ah, alloy rim. Ah, but it's manual now. It's manual, yeah. You even have a tent. Price. Is there a point three? One point three. Wait, wait, wait. Okay, this is what happened. Hey, okay. We'll call you for phone. I get your card here. Yeah. Eh? Oh, yeah. oh boy. You know something, guys? <laughs> I mean, just take a look at what you got right here. 1.2 million grand. Damn. Me, I never knew you making money. It was just easy, man. <laughs> hey guys, I don't know, I, I feel guilty about all this, man. Oh, uh, there you go again, Ruby. You're feeling guilty about money? <laughs> okay, how about I give you this to spend? <laughs> Are you still gonna feel guilty about spending it? <laughs> hey, you heard him. <laughs> Say about his brother. Ruby! <laughs> hey, listen, man. Ruby, there's another thing here you don't want to know that I'm going on a cruise trip with my beautiful Betty next week to the Caribbean. Yeah, we're going to be popping crystal caviar. My day shoes on, the splash, it's a looter. <laughs> Is that what you want to do with your money? Straight up. Take Betty to the Caribbean on a cruise? Mm -hmm. What's wrong with that? Anyway, whatever. Just give me my own shit and I'm out of here. Oh, oh. Yeah, you can have it, man. I don't cheat nobody. You know I would do. Damn. For. for the good time you gave me in Jamaica. Oh, come on. Get out of here. That was nothing, man. Listen, if you continue to be my sunshine, mm -hmm. baby girl, I'm going to give you paradise on there. Really? For real, man. <laughs> um, I'll be here for you today, forever. And always. You make me sweat. Let's do you guys. This is two weeks now. No trace or call from Chris. I wonder if he's still alive. He took a trip abroad. Yes. That's what his friends told me.
wait, 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 wait. What do you mean by that, Jane? I mean, did somebody tell you I was dead? Wouldn't it have been better than to have heart attack for a son? Mm. Uh, hi, Dad. Men, seven demons take your soul. Hey, Daddy. Shut the trap! Daddy. Huh? Come. What sort of son are you? Tell me. So, you want to live your life the way you want it? Huh? Look, um... Dad, I'm warning you, don't insult me, I'm begging you. Oh please, Chris, don't talk to Daddy like that. This is Daddy, eh? Oh wait, Daddy, who doesn't spend money for me? You want me to give him some respect? Yeah. Is he God? You're trash. Me, please. Are you mad? Me, please. Oh, you don't know I'm your god. Huh? Stop. Chris, hit me. Hit me. Hit me. No, don't hit me. What is wrong with you? Chris, honey, please. Hit me. Call God into this. Don't call God. Your father tampered Chris. He caused it all. Oh, you blame it on me? Yes. Yes. Oh, it's okay. I told you. <laughs> it's okay. No problem. I'll take the blame. Can you imagine that just because he wanted to know where we're being for that two weeks? Mwah! For Chris O'Korean, aka Bastard? God. Chris, he's your father, okay? He has the right to know your whereabouts. He's just a concerned father, that's all. Oh, please, man. No, let me tell you something, man. I'm a big boy right now. I'm not accountable to him in any way. I run my own things right now, all right? You so, heard me? So what I could take care of myself without him. I could survive. Okay, so what are you going to do? Hmm? Hmm? Look, I'm just going to go back there, pick up my baggage, and leave. You know what I mean? I got my destiny to catch up with. I could survive without him, man. I could survive because... I'm a man of my own, man. Um, um you can you can move in with me, okay? We we'll both survive together. Oh, well, sure, right, we can. Why not? I'll just take it easy. Um, um, I'm sorry. You feel better now. <laughs>
Who goes there? Every minute of tearing them apart. Fifteen years, fifteen good years, Betty, I served him. But when my wife, your mother, was sick in the hospital, what did I get? Please, please. My wife is dying in the hospital and she needs to be flown to the specialist hospital in Lagos immediately. I've watched my dinner. Sir, sir, please help me. Please leave my house. Sir, please. Madam, please don't let my wife Dada, die. Please. Leave Madam, my please, house. Please, don't let my wife die, please. She's everything I have. I said leave my house. Please, Do you, you want me to call the security man? <laughs> don't push your house. I will call in the security man to chase your house. But nobody thought about my little daughter. Auntie Nessie took care of me. care of me with the little money she made from her petty trading and she never failed to remind me that I have a father we always visited you in jail on my 18th birthday after I got admission to the university Auntie Mercy died I was a little dad. Then I turned to prostitution. <sighs> My daughter started the flesh trade to pay for her school fees because my wife is dead. I was in prison. Or because of Chief Okoria's negligence. A heartless man. I became motherless because of him. I became a prostitute because of him. In prison, I became heartless. As each day passed. The thought of how to have my pound of flesh became an obsession until we hashed a plot. Yes, Dad. And Chris was used as a bait. And he fell for it. Now he's in my hands. And I'll make sure he brings down his father.
and the soul of my beloved wife, your mother, who rest in perfect peace. So, Dad, what's the next move? What's the next plan? I'll use all the money you've been collecting from the sun to get arms and ammunition. And we'll lure him into an robbery. Betty, things might get messy and dirty for now. I don't care, Dad. I don't care. Dad, I've been a prostitute. You're an ex convict. I mean, what other family values do we have? It's your still my daughter. I don't want you to be hurt. Dad, I'm doing this because of mama. I'm doing this because of mother. Yourself. Do you know you have turned a dog? Oh, really? Well, I learned it from you. I mean, the dogs in your parade. My parade. Do you know whom you are talking to, Chris? Do you know? Oh, oh really? Oh, oh yes. 
I know. I know you are my father, isn't it? The one who spends all his money on politics rather take care of his own son? Oh, Woman, you sit there and watch your son insult me? Don't, don't huh? bring me into this. I was the mother. I told you. I warned you. Oh, yes. He's your favorite son who will inherit a political dynasty. Oh, oh Sugun. Mama, I'm tired and sick of all this. Eh? Oh, God, I'm so, so, so. Oh, I'm so, so, so. Stop that nonsense. Let him go. Just love. Mm hmm. Just for you. What's eating you up? Hmm? Too many things, ma'am. Too many things, you know what I'm saying? Well, you know, I really need to make money fast, you know, real fast. Um, do you have an idea how to? Maybe, well, let's just say yes. 
but um, I need to talk to my friends tomorrow. Something good? Mm -hmm. Something like what? Well, um, how about if we are start leaving our dreams again, you know? Make it reality, man. <laughs> how do we go about that? Get out of here. Remember the last car sales, how much money we made from it? You mean from the car we stole? Whatever. But let me tell you, we made quick, easy cash. Listen, we got guts, we got skills, we got brains. So what do you all think? Hmm? I mean, we could repeat the last operation. Listen, the last operation was mere luck. I mean, I'm not ready to take any other risk. Hey, come on, Ruby. <laughs> what are you talking about? Life itself is full of risk. Come on, man. I'm willing to go an extra mile, man, just to oh, make some extra cash. <laughs> Get out of here. Look at this. You're the man, man. You, I like your spirit, man. God bless you. <laughs> yeah, yes. Yeah. Hey, that's all right. Uh, what we're gonna do right now is um, I was thinking um, yeah um, how about if we acquire guns, you know? Guns? Did I hear you say guns? Yeah, guns. Are they not? So what do you want, old man? I've been looking for you guys. You don't understand that? <laughs> I've been listening to your conversation. I like what I heard. Skills. Gods. Brains. I love that. And who are you for my ass? Um, I am a man who wants to survive at all costs. So, I am also an ex convict. I have got guns. I need to form a team. From what I overheard, what you guys are thinking is what I'm thinking. And, uh, where could that be? Cash, of course. <laughs> Trust you. Don't trust me because I trust no one. Let's just say we are about to be 
partners in crime. Okay, that's it. That's just it. Let's pretend I wasn't here. I didn't hear anything. I don't know you. Okay, and, and I'm about to take my leave. Hey, Ruby. 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 so attached to each other. I know, I know, but you have me going. You know, so nice so we can get married. Huh? I love you so much. I, I love you too. I love you so much. But I have this feeling. I have this feeling that Chris is going to put himself in trouble. Oh, come on. Don't be pessimistic here, yeah, okay? Let's just keep our fingers crossed and hope for the best. Okay? Magazine of 30 rounds! Stand loud! Can you see a target there? Yes, yes sir. sir! Fire! 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 All out! Number one, clear sir! Sure. Number two, clear sir! Sure. Number three, clear sir! Sure. Now, 
Nah, eh, which country come from this one? Nah, he could put us in here. Where this driver now? Ah, what's the word you want to say? Driver bed. Mo, come out of bed. Nah, where I want to go? So, madam, how much is your money? 500 naira. Worry, worry. But the boss is not your field dog. I'll pay, I'll pay. Let's go for all. Let's go, let's go. on rampage. This is ridiculous. This town is becoming hot. Huh? No hiding place again. Okay. When I pick the party's gubernatorial ticket, I will make the eradication of crime my campaign slogan. Eradication of crime. <laughs> I like that. <laughs> yes. What's the problem? Hmm? What's the problem? Talk to me now. What's the problem? Well, I, I told her I had a surprise for you. Yeah. Yes, uh-huh. No. Oh my god.
money, 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 money. Yeah, baby. <laughs> thank you so much. Mm. Hold this for me. There you go. Yeah, baby. It's awesome. Oh, thank you. <laughs> oh, thank you so much. Yep. What is the hand for? <laughs> oh, thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. Talk about love, baby girl. <laughs> Thank you so much. You got this ready, my girl. For me? Mm. All this for me? Yeah. Why don't we all, you know? Yes, that will bring him back. He's gone and he's gone. It's all right. Mommy. <laughs> it's okay, it's okay Daddy. The first a crazy left the house. <laughs> and now <laughs> Sam is shocked. Uh, Jen, take heart. Jen, you are not alone. All these tears shall pass us. Okay? And in two days' time, I am very sure good news will come our way. On Friday the 16th precisely, I'll pick the party's gubernatorial ticket. Oh God, honey, please, don't even call me that. It's okay, it's okay. Mama. It's okay. Please. Oh, please. Oh, sweetheart, take care. Oh, take care. Jenny, it's okay. It's okay, it's okay. my baby. Mm. It's okay, dear. Okay. Okay. Chief, the chief. Today seems to be the happiest day of my life. Honestly, the happiest day. Do you know what it means? Transpiring from an ordinary party member to the exalted seat of the chief executive. Today is the day. <laughs> this is actually the day. I will pick the party's ticket. You see, it is always good when you plant, you reap. Eh? My colleagues were there folding their hands, pre pretending as if they don't know what is going on.
Don't know. You know each other? At long last, we're all united. One happy family. Ruby! Yes, your father sent me to jail. Why? Because I vented my anger on him. He couldn't pay my wife's hospital bill. I went to jail. My daughter became a prostitute. Who's your daughter? Betty. Betty? Don't shoot him, okay? Daddy, I, I love him. You love him? Please. <laughs> no, no, no! <coughs> no!